The problem goes like this. You're given a singly linked list and an integer n. Your task is to remove the nth node from the end and return the head of the updated list. Here, we assume n is at least 1 and no larger than the length of the list. For example, suppose the list is 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and n equals 2. The second node from the end is 4. After we remove it, the list becomes 1, 2, 3, and 5. The most straightforward way is to first traverse the list and count its length. Then, traverse it again and stop at the node right before the target, which is at position length minus n. From there, adjust its pointer to skip the target node. This works, but it needs two passes, which feels a bit clunky. A more elegant solution is to use the two-pointer technique, often called fast and slow pointers. This way, we only need one pass. The idea is simple. First move the fast pointer n steps ahead, then move both fast and slow pointers forward at the same time. When the fast pointer reaches the end, the slow pointer will be right before the node we want to remove. Let's walk through the same example. The fast pointer moves two steps ahead, landing on three. Then both pointers move together. When the fast pointer reaches five, the slow pointer is at three, which is just before the target node four. Now we update the link from three to point to five, effectively removing four. But what if the node to remove is actually the head? For instance, the list is one, two, three, and n equals three. That means we want to delete node one. Without extra handling, the fast and slow pointer method can't locate the node before the head, and that causes issues. To fix this, we introduce a dummy node in front of the list. Let's say the dummy has the value negative one, and its next pointer points to the head. Now the list looks like negative one, one, two, and three. Both pointers start from the dummy. The fast pointer moves three steps and reaches the end, while the slow pointer stays on the dummy that puts it right before node one, which is the node we need to remove. Then we simply set dummy.next to point to two, and node one is deleted. Here's the corresponding Python code. This function first creates a dummy node pointing to the head, so removing the head or any other node can be handled in the same way. The fast pointer moves n steps, then both fast and slow pointers move together. When the fast pointer reaches the end, the slow pointer is exactly before the node to delete. By setting slow.next equal to slow.next.next, the target node is removed. The whole process only traverses the list once, so the time complexity is O of n, and the space complexity is O of 1.